Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with Google Analytics. Our viewer is implementing Google Analytics in an Ionic and Angular application and has successfully set up user ID tracking. They've added a custom dimension called environment and can see it in the behavior overview tab. However, they want to display this custom dimension alongside user ID in the user explorer view. Let's explore how they can achieve this without having to click through each user individually. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question going through some of the answers and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To add a custom dimension column in the User Explorer view of Google Analytics, first, ensure that your custom dimension is properly set up in your Google Analytics account. Next, you need to ensure that the custom dimension is being sent with the user ID tracking in your Ionic and Angular application. This involves modifying your tracking code. After confirming that the data is being sent correctly, navigate to the User Explorer section in Google Analytics. Here, you can view individual user data. Unfortunately, Google Analytics does not allow you to add custom dimension columns directly in the User Explorer view. However, you can use segments to filter users by the environment dimension. Finally, while you cannot see the environment column directly, using segments will help you identify users from specific environments without clicking through each user. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Unfortunately, adding a custom dimension column in the User Explorer view of Google Analytics is not a valid feature. You can find more details on this topic in the support documentation. And that's it. I hope you found the solution that you're looking for. If you did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.